How do you like my mic placement? How do you like my t-shirt? All right, pie dough. It's one of those things that intimidates people. The method that I use uses no equipment. It has four ingredients and it takes 10 minutes. So this is one cup plus two tablespoons of all-purpose flour, a teaspoon of granulated sugar, half a teaspoon of salt. So the first thing is just to toss the dry ingredients together. One stick of butter. This is really cold butter. Don't worry about anything you've read about how big or small these pieces of butter need to be. And what I need to do now is just toss it and the, the flour is basically coating the butter. See, this butter is properly cold and you can tell because it's actually hard to push it into any shape. What I'm trying to do here is just get the butter into long, thin sheets. See how some butter is actually sticking to the rolling pin? Nothing to be scared of, just scrape it off. So I've got all these long sheets of butter. It's still really nice and cold, so it's flexible. I'm gonna pick everything up it looks light and flaky, and I'm, I'm being quick about it because I don't want to overwork and I don't want the butter to melt. Next, this is three tablespoons of ice water, and I'm tossing it together. I'm just really trying to distribute the water that I added. So there's still some really big pieces. There's some smaller pieces. For most of this video, you're gonna look at it and say, wow, that looks like a giant mess. Looks like a hot mess, Carla, what are you doing? This is where your pie dough begins. If the rolling pin starts to stick, I will add more flour. And now I'm using the bench scraper. I'm scraping underneath the dough and flipping it over. I'm trying not to handle it too much with my bare hands because they're warm. So I'm just gonna add a little flour underneath. So this is roll number two. I always like to flour the pin over the dough and that way I'm sort of sprinkling it on top at the same time. And you can see there's dry pieces out on the edges of the dough, but the middle is starting to look like kind of creamy and holding together. So I think there's just gonna be one more flip. All right, so again, folding it over one way. This is perfect. I'm trying not to warm the dough up and not to overwork the flour because that's what gives you a tough as opposed to a tender crust. So this is where I wanna stop you're gonna chill this dough. And as it sits in the fridge, it's going to rehydrate. This is a rectangle and most pie plates are round, but I'm actually going to shape it once I've got the saran wrap. The dough is finished, four ingredients, about 10 minutes, flakiest pie dough ever. Does it look like a wet, hot mess? I mean, it does, but that's kind of the point. It looks wrong, but it's right.